Now please come to questions 18 to 22. Complete the summary using the list of words A to I below. Now what you have to do, there is a summary. First you will read the question in the summary, then you will go back to the passage, find the word, and then you will just find the word number here. Number means A, B, C, D. Okay, let's start. Whether during the little ice age. I'm going to read question number 18. Documentation of past weather conditions is limited. Our main sources of knowledge of conditions in the distant past are and then another one. So what is our main sources of knowledge of conditions in the distant past? Distant past means long ago past. You know we use the word distant relatives. Dur ka so let's go back. They talk about these things in paragraph C. All of you, please come to paragraph C. Reconstructing the climate changes in the past. Whether during the little ice age and they use the word past. So we would scan the word past. So please focus now. Paragraph C. Reconstructing the climate changes of the past is extremely difficult because systematic weather observations began only a few centuries ago in Europe and North America. Next, records from India and tropical Africa are even more recent. For the time before records began, we have only proxy records reconstructed largely from tree rings and ice cores. Now come back. Distant past are so three rings and I scores. Yes, it's going to be three rings first. That is option C, and second is I scores, and that is going to be B. So you should write them in the same order C and then B because they came in the same order. So, question number 18 answer is three rings, and 19 answer is B. That is uh, ice cores. Clear? And you will not write the words. You will only write the letters. Okay. Question number 20. Now you will find the answers in the same order. We can deduce that the little ice age was a time of dash rather than of consistent freezing. I mean it was not the time of freezing. It was time of maybe melting or something like that. So let's go back. Time off. All right, the same summary. Okay, answers. I mean, this answer is not here in paragraph C. I'm sorry, you'll have to come back to paragraph B. See, they confuse us like this as well. Just pick up the clue word, and the clue word is we can deduce that the little ice age was a time off rather than consisting, uh, consistent freezing. So please come to second paragraph. Second paragraph and there you got to come to the middle. Can you see this thing? They are the deeply important context for the current unprecedented global warming. Now, the little ice age was far from a deep freeze. Clue word was freezing. Please focus this sentence. The little ice age. Everyone found it? Yeah? Waha pe last table pe mil gaya? Okay. Yeah. The little ice age was far from a deep freeze. However, rather an irregular seesaw of rapid climatic shifts. Rapid climatic shifts. Now find something. Rapid climatic shifts. A. Well done. Or yaha pe bhi options ko kaatte jaan hai. C lag gaya. B bhi lag gaya. And A also. So just cross them so that you don't read them again. Okay, uh, well, let me tell you uh, now at present, most of the time in summary completion, questions and answers are in order. Right? Yeah. Let's go on. We've got question 21. Rather than consistent freezing, then within it, there were some periods of very cold winters, one thing, <coughs> comma, others of dash and heavy rain. Now, listen, answer will come with cold winters and heavy rains. So please now come back to same paragraph B. Look for the word winters and rains. Found it? Paragraph B, last three lines. 
the seesaw brought cycles everyone there yes, the seesaw brought cycles of intensity cold intensely cold winters and easterly winds then switched abruptly of years of heavy spring and early summer rains now one thing is intensely cold winters which is given second is easterly winds which is not given and then they say rains so what could be the answer yes and if you go on just go on a little let's just read on uh years of uh, okay after after easterly wind then switched abruptly to years of heavy spring and early summer rains mild winters this is first thing frequent atlantic storms to the periods droughts light and then summer heat wave so the answer is going to be yeah storm is for heavy winds okay h is already taken cross h as well heavy rain okay now come to 22 and yet others that saw dash with no rain at all something with no rain at all exactly yes they said there if you read on they say or the periods of droughts uh light not easterly winds and summer heat waves so the question is heat wave and yet others that saw with no rain at all can you tell me what is the word for no rain at all yeah periods of droughts drought means no rain at all kahat sali khushk sali that's what we call it so over here the answer is g now please listen for question number 18 answer is c question number 19 answer is b question number 20 it's a and question number 21 it's h and question number 22 it's g now we go on we've got another challenging question type 